Wither Skeleton Skulls, uh, which hopefully we're going to find today. I'm Winter, and this is Pasty Parcel. I'm going to fix my inventory real quick, and I'll be immediately back with you guys. And I'm back! Whoa, 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 Mr. Enderman! Don't teleport, no, no. My house is off limits, you cannot park in here. <laughs> Where'd you go? Okay, this case scare me, so I'm just going to run away. Poor random man. So, we're ready to go for some successful wither skeleton skull hunting in the nether. I go through the portal. Here I am. We're a tiny bit of frame rate lag, nothing I can handle. And we're off. It is took me a long while to. Look at that guy! <laughs> He's reflecting on the mysteries of life and death. And everything in between. And he's just made a new friend now. Hello, mister. I'll let you to your reflections. I'm leaving because I have a mission. So, we're going to collect the skulls. And, uh, as you know, the nether is really, really, really hot with lava everything, everywhere and this whole hell resemblance thingy. So I removed them. I, I removed my clothes. As you can see, uh, I have no armor, s uh, symbols, uh, thingies, drawings on top of my heart because I'm not wearing any armor. I mean, armor is for cowards. Seriously, who who goes to the nether wearing anything at all? That's just silly. But here I am. My inventory is ready to face the challenges right here. So I have a plan, of course. Uh, you should never be in the nether without some fire resistance. And possibly also... A potion of invisibility. <laughs> this is what I was uh, doing. Also, I'll drink one speed potion because why not? This is also why it took me a tiny bit too much time to set up. I was simply brewing potions. Uh, not only that, but I kind of um, noticed that we only had one brown, mu brown, <laughs> one brown mushrooms, and uh, to make all these invisibility potions, I needed a bunch of. Uh, Spider eyes thingies, what are they called? Uh, fermented spider eyes? There was a moment of, uh, I turned around and I couldn't see where I was anymore. <laughs> where am I? <laughs> ah, I was going here because Manchimo did not finish this place, so I should do that. Uh, uh, his pickaxe broke too early. I should have maybe enchanted the, well, whatever. What was I saying? What was I saying? I don't remember what I was saying. Oh yeah, no, uh, I had to make... Uh, Mushrooms grow. I'll show you that once I'm back at the base later. But yeah, the point I had a plan, and that's uh, I am not really a good builder, uh, and I'm not really good at planning things either. I I'm the only person here. That's the reason why so far all of my episodes were about caving. That's the one thing I can do, but as for Building platforms where a specific mob can spawn more easily and be easier to kill for us? Uh, no, that's not my thing. So I'm just... God, those particles were weird. I'm just going to finish what the Munchmo couldn't. And then I'll start the hunting and not really do much else besides making... Uh, a couple of places that are a bit more spawn friendly, we'll talk about it later. But uh, as for the potions, the plan is that uh, no matter which mob I come across, uh, it can't attack me if I'm completely invisible. So I can hit uh, those pesky wither skeletons safely. Oh, I need to check the upstairs indeed, so I'm going to just place this stuff back in here. The upstairs is not yet finished. Hello, guys, because uh, there, as you can see, this is right where a wither skeleton just spawned. Uh, this area is only two blocks high. Uh, wither skeletons are three blocks high. And, however, they share the same ID with normal skeletons. So, what does this mean? Uh, it means that they behave uh, like normal skeletons uh, for most uh, things. Uh, which means that they can they can spawn in areas where they're not supposed to because they're actually taller than what they think they are. So they can, for example, spawn here. 
But if they do, they start suffocating because they do take suffocation damage in a smaller area than what they're supposed to be in. Uh, Mr. Pigman, please move. I wouldn't want to hit you. There we go. See, that was completely safe. So that's my plan for today. I'm just going to sneak on any wither skeleton I see and ruin their days. Their day. Because <laughs> they only have one left. Just something here. Do, 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 do. So yeah, that area above there, the, it still needs to be half a block higher, because otherwise the uh, citizen is going to spawn there and immediately die to suffocation, and we will not get the rare the rare drop if that happens. Uh, or I'm pretty sure they don't drop it unless the player kills them. But even if they do, we're probably going to miss them and they're going to despawn. Now I'm going to take on these torches because there is no reason why we should have torches in places where we need skeletons to spawn. Again, because of the shared ID with the normal skeletons, um, with their skeletons uh, are not like blazes, uh, in that blazes can spawn uh, even under a light level of 11, I believe? Um, hmm. It's in here. Have we ever been here? Ooh, this keeps going for a little, for a long while. Up oh, and doesn't lead anywhere, so we can just close this, I believe. Uh, but instead, uh, they need uh, they need uh, a light level of seven or less. So if we have torches lying around, the wither skeletons will have uh, trouble spawning at all. So no, we must not have torches around. Sorry, Berg, but uh, we can't have that. Uh, it, it was Berg who placed all those torches around, I believe, because... I don't know why, maybe just to show where we have explored the things. And... Uh, because... Burger videos are too dark, blur! <laughs> How are you doing here? Still two minutes of invisibility and a health. Invisibility and a health. Now, uh, uh, spawning with a skeleton spawning behavior. Walls. Uh, most walls uh, in fortresses are actually possible spawning areas, which means that if I were to take down just one block here, and here, and here, and so on, uh, this area here is some uh, gamed uh, floor place where uh, wither skeletons, but not just them, can spawn. Uh, stairs too. Stairs, uh, this area right here is a... Uh, uh, an area that uh, will allow things to spawn uh, if there are no blocks on the way, which is why I'm taking down these stairs. Uh, they don't seem to lead anywhere anyways. Uh, maybe they do lead somewhere, actually. Oops. <laughs> Doesn't matter. I'm not sure if they can spawn here where the nether wart is. Can mom spawn soul sand anyways? I'm really not sure, so just to be safe, I'm going to switch it around. You're probably yelling at me right now if it's if this is uh, maybe it is maybe they, maybe they can't actually spawn here and so I'm just wasting my time, but it is I don't care. Um uh, I think I'm actually not going to dig out the walls here, because there is uh, an area that we were where we were before a moment ago, that is actually a much better... has a much better chance of spawning things, so I'm going to get back there. Right up here, actually. Careful, because... Invisibility is useless if I bump against the mobs. Because they are going to see me. Why is this blocked? What's in here that is so scary? Hmm. Nothing? Oh, man! This is... this is beautiful. This like tri tri triple intersection this is perfect uh, oh oh is there a spawner <laughs> is that why oh mushrooms is that why that area was blocked where am i going oh this is where uh, the thing i just opened a moment ago also with their skeleton oh there's three of them and they need to drink another invisibility right now if I don't want to mess things up uh, right here. Well, I don't really need uh, another fire resistance right now. I should just get those guys before they despawn. 
Oh, they're stuck on the fences. That is hilarious. Now, I'm going to get them. Oh, maybe it's going to walk up where I am. Oh, but, but you can't see me. You're not seeing me, aren't you? Oh, you're... <laughs> Let's not get the... Uh, ...swarded in the lava. Whoa, that was kind of dangerous. If... if that guy dropped a skull, I would have dropped in the lava. I would have been pissed. Like, really mad. Maybe these fences need to go, because we can't have all these guys. Oh, crap! There was no skull in there, was there? We... Oh, that's a normal skeleton. What? How did you get there? See, we're also safe from skeletons. Unless I bump into that guy. How am I going to... Okay, so if I sh shoot... It's not really the bad thing. How am I going to hit you? Well, okay, actually, if I shoot at the wither, I think he's going to see me and chase me, so we can... Well, this makes things a tiny bit harder. <laughs> I don't know what to do. <laughs> I guess we'll have time to leave the guy over there. <laughs> <laughs> that was inconvenient. <laughs> oh boy. There is no need for. Well, no, actually, I'm not going to touch the air that Berg was working on. That would be. That would be mean. Oh! We're safe from gas, too. Let's. Uh, I really need to keep an eye out on the time, because I don't want to accidentally run out of invisibility. So, we saw. This intersection right here. Intersections are the best place for things to spawn in, unless all those torches are here. So, uh, this is a wall, and this is a wall too, that is a wall of this area here. So you, I can take down all these things. Crap, I really should have tried to put some efficiency on this pick. I completely forgot about it, and now my job is going to be much slower. Good job, Winter. <laughs> oh, well... What can I do about it? So yeah, that's that's a plan. That's a that's my plan for this episode of Passy Parcel. Just to stay invisible, sneak attack the wither skeletons. Uh, hopefully get a skull. Oh, that would be amazing. Talking about it, uh, before I before I played in here, I started a single player world to uh, mess around in the nether, figure out where wither skeletons tend to spawn most and the best way to kill them and such. So I got there, I had a loot diamonds ward just like the one we have right now. I got there, uh, I killed the first wither skeleton I saw and it dropped a skull. I, I kid you not. And I was so mad because I knew that that would never happen in my episode of Passive Parcel. I, I felt cheated. <laughs> like, like my girlfriend was telling me, hey look at this, this will never happen to you in Passive Parcel. <laughs> mean, mean game. This is genius. This air was blocked, but there was a way dug through here. <laughs> okay, well these walls need to go anyways. Um, of course, by opening all of these areas, I am allowing their skeletons to roam, roam free, which is what these things uh, were trying to prevent. So, as long as I'm invisible, that's fine. But if other players do not want to use invisibility potions, and I can understand that because it does take nuggets. <gasps> I eat some gold, no! <laughs> uh... Yeah, that kind of ruins their plans, so... Sorry, guys! <laughs> See, this is a possible era for them to spawn in, and they won't because... Well, they will! The problem is that they will, and they will die immediately! That's evil! We can't allow that to happen! Wither skeletons are protected species! And I don't know what I'm saying. I need to make some inventory room. I do need... Did I check down this place, by the way? There's nothing here. And just, oops, this, this, I can't close this. I, I can't just close this. It's completely worthless. Worthless. Three minutes left. 
I do hear footsteps, I just don't know... Well, I think wither skeletons make those bone sounds when they move, they don't have normal footsteps. Uh, so these that I'm hearing cannot possibly be skeletons, maybe? Hmm, I think so. About me, and not specifically about Pesty Parcel now. Yeah, stuff with the channel up and then the, it was... Uh, it took the longest break uh, since when I started making videos in the first place. Uh, let's just say I'm fine. I can't wait to start uh, back properly and hopefully never ever stop again for any reason whatsoever. And I am going to try to leave it at that. Uh, Maybe you were hoping for some more stuff, some more news, but no, that's that's it. <laughs> that's it for me. I um There is something else to mention. Uh is this going to pop back here? No, it won't. Uh, still have one extra minute. Let's pick up these blocks, uh, which are good, useful to munch Um I don't know what happened here. <laughs> we can start taking out torches, actually. Let me mention something, just, just vaguely, just vaguely, just to give you an idea. A general whoop. That, that was my phone. Just to give you a general idea of uh, uh, stuff that I've been. Oh my goodness, that sounded like a baby crying. In real life, I don't know why I was looking at the Minecraft window as I said that. <laughs> uh, dangerous lava. Uh, that, that could be a good spawnable area. But no, I'm not messing with the lava in the nether. I can just uh, close this too. Uh, let's see. I had uh, issues, pretty important uh, ones recently, that luckily were fixed before bad things happened and now everything is okay and nothing bad is going to happen to me uh, and on the good side on the good news side ooh, drink a potion no, 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 that's <laughs> okay I still haven't found a valid alternative to nom 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 as far as potions are concerned I'm sorry Right now, that all those issues are fixed and stuff, I finally find myself uh, in the position of uh, thinking about the future and making plans for the future. And the nice thing about it is that I actually have uh, a future. I have uh, dreams and I have things that I can't wait to accomplish. Uh, and they're going to make uh, my life uh, wonderful. What is... What is this? I've never been here. What is this? What is this? Where am I? What am I doing? Oh, I'm back here. I don't understand, but I'll take down these walls. I have uh, something to look uh, forward to. And that's something is just amazing, and I think about it every day, and I'm going to work towards that to accomplish it as soon as I can. And while I'm not, I'm still not going to go into the details. I am going to say that uh, I wish everybody had uh, the kind of hopes and dreams that I have currently, because everybody, every single human being, deserves that. Uh, so, I can't complain, and the only thing I can complain about is that I just wish these things happened sooner. But besides that, uh, yeah, it's just, uh, I actually feel like I finally have some sort of, let's say, purpose. Uh, maybe purpose is the wrong word. There's actually a staircase here. Yeah, this is a staircase. That was very well hidden. Hmm. Fences. 
Yeah, this area right here can... Ooh, I could have punched a pigman by accident. This area right here can spawn a whole bunch of wither skeletons. In general, all the roofs of the fortresses, although there is one exception, are wonderful uh, spawning platforms. So I should also take a good look at this, maybe make uh, some easier way to access it. To summarize... I have something very happy and wonderful that I'm going to work so that it's going to happen so I'm going to realize it as soon as possible and eventually I'm going to tell about it careful guy and uh, it's well it's just the good the news of the day just uh, <laughs> nothing uh, I kind of wanted to mention I I'm planning the, my future here, my life, and... Uh, yeah, my future and my life, that's it. <laughs> and it's going to bring huge changes in my life, which is... Uh, I, re I I know, I, 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 I am perfectly aware of the fact that it's going to be really, really, really difficult. Uh, there's going to be issues, there's going to be hard times. Uh, but it's all going to be worth it in the end, so... Yup! Now, uh... Yeah, that's it. I added an extra floor here because this area too, where nothing was, uh, is actually a spawning... Uh, a, a, a valid spawning place. Uh, what's that guy doing? So yeah, I added this, although... Uh, if I wanted to do a better job, I would also do this and do the entire border so that we make sure not to fall off, but... Uh, you'll just have to watch your step! <laughs> <laughs> I really need to constantly check on my invisibility. Let's see. Uh, we appear to have been up here. Did I rhyme? I just rhymed. <laughs> Guess we've been here. And again, this is completely worthless if it's lit up. Gosh darn it. <laughs> there we go. Where does this keep going? Does it go for a long while or does it kind of just end? Oh, this is another intersection, so it should not be lit up. Hello. Nothing around here, and this kind of just ends. Well, these fires around here are not going to help me. Oh, I know where I am. Oh, look at all the... The wither... Skeletons... Persons! I still have three minutes, and oh my goodness, where have I gotten myself into? Where have I gotten myself into? That's cor perfectly correct. Oop. Wonderful. Let's go get the uh, sun. <laughs> Let's go get... No, that guy despawned in my face. I was looking uh, at the wither skeleton and he just despawned and left a blaze in his place. Ah, ridiculous. It's already difficult to farm for these guys. They can't despawn while I'm looking at them. Huh. Oh, more Minecraft related news. Nom 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 nom. 1.6 is out. And I was like the last person to notice. Look at that guy. Uh, because I was too busy playing scrolls. Could you. That guy is running away from me. Come here! Would have been better if I managed to. I should have free space in my inventory. I should have free space in my inventory. <laughs> okay, I'm 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 getting lost. Uh, I was trying to see 1.6. Yes, I was too busy playing scrolls to notice that 1.6 was out. So um, yeah, <laughs> I plan on eventually starting to make videos about scrolls too because scrolls is amazing and it's been uh, keeping me occupied. Look at all the blazes. I th I think we still have a spawner over there that needs to be taken care of. Just. Uh, Next person in line, or the next one, or the next one, but anybody else but me are going to get the fire resist potion and just get in there and break the thing. Okay, you. Oh, whoa, there's two of you. Uh, before I do something stupid, I'm going to drink another one. No, 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 no,
right next to a blaze. Oh goodness, this guy walked right up towards me. <laughs> I almost bumped into him. Oh, this is the staircase. Uh, let's uh, make some more space here. More like this and just have... Uh, uh, I am afraid of... Uh, bun bumping into the blaze. Okay, this is... You can go through here. It's good enough. <laughs> uh, it we have. I can throw this away. Let's take another look here. I don't remember if there was something important uh, over here. Oh no, this ends. This is, I, I'm pretty sure this, this ends. This just ends, so I should close it. This is an intersection instead, so... This could be made a tiny bit larger too. How much time do we have left? Uh, not really much, actually. Right? So I'll have, I'll have to leave soon. All these blazes are starting to worry me, though. Oh yeah, I was going to talk about 1.6, actually. Here's the thing I really don't like about 1.6. The zombie spawning behavior. That's... Okay, I, I realize it's tied to the difficulty, and if I feel like it's too difficult, I can just stop playing on hard. But this is a kind of fake difficulty. You don't make a game harder by making uh, a mob that uh, you kill it, and because you killed it, now there's two more of them. And after you have killed those two, there's four more of them. That is not difficulty, that is just uh, annoyingly boring and uh, why did I place this here and uh, useless and lazy no it, it doesn't work you can't do that you have to tone it down you can't have so many zombies spawning every single time you hit one that's just not cool no no don't do that I, I don't mind this. They, they, and no they see you from too far away Plus, there's the problem with the lag that when they can't pass find their way to you no. <laughs> 1.6 honestly did not make me too happy. Horses despawning, that, that, uh, mobs taking a whole bunch of fall damage if they hang from a, from a leash. <laughs> yeah, that's, is my summarized opinion of 1.6. That's another fortress right there, look at that. And this time I do have fog on, I, I swear, I, I have the fog, <laughs> I think. That is another fortress right there, look at that. It might also be an extension of this. I don't need those. Interesting, if anybody wishes to check it out, you just kind of have to go past this area and... Uh, the torch I totally may be affecting spawns, uh, so I'll put it here. I'm going to take a quick look at the f roof. Uh, Nothing here. I'm going to take a quick look at our first original spawning gear, which is over there, and I don't know how to reach it now that I think about it. Uh, I can make a staircase down here. Anything over there? No. Alright. Let's just dig down. I think there is... Uh, no, there is no lava uh, precipice of doom and sadness and destruction. There we go, we can just simply get down here and move over here, look at there, no, no withers. This wasn't really a very productive uh, episode, was it? <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. And this really didn't uh, give us too much stuff either. Oh well. Well, I talked about the most things I wanted to talk about. Also, I'm going to leave some... Uh, oh. We need another chest. Let's just uh, make uh, ourselves a favor. How's my invisibility? Wonderful. Still have time. Just... Uh... <laughs> okay, let's bring this back home, actually. This is where we'll need it. I can lay a fire resist here in our inventory. Oh, and we ran out of magma cube creams, so I'm going to bring half of those back. Uh, although, having a thing over there, a brewing stand, would be kind of a good idea. But yeah, that's, uh, that's it for today. 
uh, back to my YouTube channel. Just uh, um, uh, I'm going to be back into business real, real soon. Like a couple of days soon. Actually, I am back into business just by making this video, mostly, sort of, not really. Uh, but yeah, Sword Adventures, Corrupt Kingdoms. Corrupt Kingdoms is like taking me forever to finish, that's... <laughs> uh, but I promise that once I can get back into recording properly... I think... I think I should do this. I think I should... I, I think... I'm going to make this official now. I'm going to upload one video every day, starting from uh, not now. <laughs> but I will. I should really just... Uh, promise myself and you viewers this one video every day I of any kind of series not just one so it won't be super fat adventures every day or anything else every day but the one video every day that's what I can promise did I feed the chickens I don't remember if I oh that's uh... I got the chicken hey no <laughs> Perfect. Oh, more eggs. No, no, I wanted to throw the eggs. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> These poor villagers, they didn't do anything wrong. Wait, uh, did I just see my arm for a second there? That was weird. Maybe I just imagined it. But yeah, we're here. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed yourself. And now it's the next uh, person in line, which is uh, Ix's turn. See you next time and have a nice day.